Hey y'all. <laughs> Welcome to a Saturday Suds on Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Bear Reviews. Hey, this week I've got a uh, a brew from my brew club. Um, it's a brew that I actually had last year uh, from my brew club from the old Busthead Brew Company out of Fauquier, Fauquier County, Virginia. Um, it's brewed and bottled in Vent Hill, Virginia by Old Busthead Brewing Company. Um, this is a Vixen, Vixen Irish style red ale. Clean and classic and malty. 5.4% alcohol by volume. Okay, they actually sent me this beer last year from Old Busthead along with a, a different brew. Um, I enjoyed it then and I'm like, you know, Saturday's when I do my my beer club brew, so we're going to re-review it. Um, Irish style red ale. I appreciate y'all joining me this Saturday. I got a little, I don't know what that is around the rim of it, but it's just got a plain old black crown, nothing on it. Let's see what it looks like. Hoping it's going to have a pretty reddish amber ruby. Ooh, goodness, look at that. Pulling it kind of hard there, see if we can get a good head on it. It's beautiful. The head is not what I expected. I expected a lot more head to poured it. I poured it as hard. Man, I poured that thing hard as I could. It looks like I should have saved a little and swished the bottom of it some. Um, but you know, <laughs> you know what? This looks exactly like the uh, twisted tea <laughs> that I did yesterday. It's got the exact same color. It's a little bit denser. A little bit more cloudy but it has the same color as the uh, twisted tea I did yesterday I did a twisted tea peach and it was good I, I didn't taste the peach in it but it was good but this looks just like it it looks like a dark tea it, the color of it um, I, I guess you could call that a red ale um, I guess maybe Anyway, <sighs> oh, it's got a very pleasant aroma, and the head is not much, and I didn't get to try the head because, I mean, I poured that thing stiff, man, and it just didn't produce much of a head. You saw the bubbles, they just kind of went shoop, and then the head went shoop, just like that. So I'm not going to be able to taste the head on it. Um, I don't know if this is... Uh, No, this one doesn't have a, uh, it doesn't have a, a best by date or anything like that on it. Um, anyway, whatever. Old Busthead. Now, Old Busthead Brewery, Old Busthead Brewing Company in Vent Hill, Virginia, is actually not too far uh, from where a classmate of mine lives in Virginia now. Um, and that's Michelle Dixon Baker. Went to school with Michelle. Um, she was one of the most beautiful women in the class of 84. Um, <laughs> and the last time I reviewed one of the old Busthead brews, she said, hey, that's not too far from where I live. So, hey, Michelle, go on down to Vent Hill and tell old Busthead Brewing Company Uncle Bub appreciates them. <laughs> now, it says the SRM, which is the color of the beer, from my understanding, is an 18. And I don't know what the scale is. I don't know how high the scale goes or anything, but this is a darker brew. I mean, it's not dark, dark, not burnt motor oil dark, like a stout or a porter or nothing like that, but it is a darker brew, as you can see. Um, it's just a darker brew. I can see a little bit of light through it, you know, that kind of thing. So an 18, I'll take them for what they say it is. 5.4% alcohol by volume. Uh, the IBUs are 23. Now, the IBUs is a, a international bitterness units. Uh, it goes up to a 150, I believe, and this is a 23. So, there's not much bitterness in this brew. So, anyway, this, uh, 
Vixen Irish Style Red Ale is for all American workers. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Thank you for the work that you do day in and day out to provide for yourselves and your families, pay your own way, and uh, support our economy and not depending on the government. I sure do appreciate y'all. I know what it's like. I do the same thing. It takes us all working together, providing goods and services for one another here in America to keep things rolling and moving. The government don't do a thing for us. So I just want y'all to know that I appreciate what you do. It don't matter what your job is. If you've got a job, you work for a living, then your job is essential and you are important. Thank you, hardworking Americans. Cheers. Oh man, that's a good brew. All right, so what I'm getting, and this, I don't know, y'all. Um, I'm limited on my scope of Irish style ales, uh, but this red ale it reminds me a whole lot of a Bach, and of course it's got the goat on it like a Bach would, but it has it has the characteristics of a Bach to me uh, when I think of Shiner Bach and some of the other Bachs I've tried they have like <clears throat> they have like kind of a, a roasty toasty type flavor to them man this has got it it's got that roasty toasty delicious uh, flavor to it um, I, I get the malty it says it's got clean classic and malty I get the malty it's not overly malty but I can taste that roasty toasty malt man it's delicious. The bitterness, uh, to me, I have a I have a high tolerance for bitterness. I'm not getting any bitterness out of this at all. I mean, it's just delicious and smooth, to me. Um, you know, it says it has 23 IBUs. That's fairly low, in my opinion. I'm not getting any bitterness. I, I, it's delicious. Easy, smooth. It's got a crispness to it. Mmm. Just a delicious brew. Um, I'm getting a hint, just a little hint of a caramel flavor in it as well. Um, the roasty, toasty, caramel, um, Easy, smooth, crisp, delicious, very, very good brew. Um, if you get a chance to try some of the Vixen Irish Style Red Ale from Old Busthead there in Vent Hill, Virginia, I, I, I recommend it, man. It's a very good brew. It's a 5.4% ABV. Um, good brew. Very, very good. Very, very uh, pleasing to the palate. Nothing offense about it, offensive about it at all. Uh, Get out of here, fly. Flies want my beer. <laughs> anyway, give these guys a shot, man. Old Busthead Brewery. Um, this makes the... Let's see, I got two last year and two this year. And one of them was the same. So I've tried three different beers by the Old Busthead, and I've enjoyed them all. So if you get a chance to try them... Did you hear that? No, I'm guessing not that. The, neighbors next door got well one door over they've got a, a goat back there I thought you might get hear him bleating anyway all right y'all that's been a Saturday Suds this week hey I love and appreciate y'all thank you for watching um hit that like button give me a subscribe if you like beer because I'm here four times a week for you every week sometimes five but mostly I'm, I'm here four every week trying something different for you I do some revisits every once in a while but most of the time I try to do something different I love making videos, I love trying different kinds of beer, and I love the American people and American worker. So y'all stay tuned. I'll be back next week for a Taste Challenge Tuesday. Got something a little different I'm going to do next week. Cheers, brothers and sisters.